Hey everybody, welcome back to Rachel's Place. Today I'll be taking a look at and unboxing the new releases from American Girl, Tenny Grant, and Logan Everest. So let's get started. The first item I'll be looking at is Tenny Grant's picnic outfit. It retails for $28 and it contains one chambray shirt, I hope I'm saying that right, one pair of crocheted shorts, and one pair of shoes. Now, as you can tell, the box is different. They did this to Gabriella's boxes as well, and they're going to make the new American Girl doll boxes look like this. The first item in this set is a pair of tennis shoes. They are mustard yellow, and they have dark purple laces. Next, we have a pair of crocheted shorts, although to me, they kind of look like lace. There is a reddish-brown belt that ties around the waist, there is Velcro in the front, and then on the back, the belt is sewn on, so you can't take it off, but I really like these shorts. I think they're really pretty, and they go well with the top. Lastly, we have this denim top with cuffs around the sleeves. There is collar around the neck. There is a pocket that actually works there is Velcro, so it's not real buttons, but at least it's easier. And I think this top is really pretty. It matches the shorts well. And on the back, it's just plain. Next, I'll be looking at Tenny's Spotlight Outfit. It retails for $36, and it contains one lace top, one glitter skirt, one embellished pair of boots, and one star headband. This outfit is really cute, and I can't wait to get it out of the box. First up, we have these lightish brown boots. These are the embellished boots, and they have tons of glitter on them. I mean tons. All different kinds. They velcro on the back, so they are very easy. The soles of the shoe are a floral design, and these match perfectly with the headband. Next, we have the headband. It is a creamy brown color with three stars, and like I said, the stars are covered in glitter, the same glitter as the boots. This is a really pretty headband, and I think it suits the outfit well. Next, we have this super glittery tutu skirt. It has so much pink glitter all over it. What's up with this girl in glitter? The first layer is a tulle, the second layer is a light pink. There is elastic at the waist, and it is plain in the back. Overall, I think this skirt is just so beautiful. Next, we have this white lace top with beautiful lace designs on it. There is a lace collar, and then the sleeves are see-through. The shirt isn't see-through, though. There's a white layer underneath. See? You can't see my fingers. Well, you can see the shape, but not the color. This is such a pretty shirt. On the back there is Velcro, so it is easy to put on your doll. Overall, I think this set is really pretty, and I highly recommend it. Next up, I'll be taking a look at Tenny Grant's accessories. It retails for $34, and it contains one guitar, one strap, one pick, and one book. And on the box, it says it plays three songs. But be warned, it needs AAA batteries. And I didn't have any. The first item of this set is the guitar. It is so beautiful. It's turquoise, and it has a beautiful floral design down the side. And there's even a little birdie! This guitar is so pretty. Like, if it was big, I would just start playing it right now. The strings actually work, and there's even the little tuners at the top. The tuners turn, and it actually says Taylor on it, and Taylor is an actual brand of guitar, which I thought was really cool. There are also three buttons on this guitar, which I'm going to show in a second. Those are for the three songs, but sadly, like I said, I don't have AAA batteries. Maybe I can get them later. The strap detaches and puts and can be put back on, so you can put it on your doll. 
I had a little trouble with this part. <laughs> it detaches on the top and the bottom. So you can just take the whole thing completely off. The strap is peach, turquoise, dark blue, and brown. And it's in a pretty design. Next we have the pick. It's a little bit chunky because it has to fit in the doll's hand. Even though the dolls have new f hand molds, it still has to be a little fat. The doll's thumb goes in the front, and in the back is where her pointer finger goes. Lastly, we have the music book. On the front, there's a beautiful floral design, and on the side, it's turquoise. There are blank pages inside, except for the very, very first page. And that says Tenny. And then this page, she wrote a song, and it's called Reach the Sky. It's so cute. It's like she actually wrote it. And like I said, in the front, it says Tenny. So everyone knows that it's hers. The next set I'll be looking at is Logan's Rhythm Drum Set. That was difficult to say. It retails for $68 and it contains one bass drum, bass drum, I hope I'm saying that right, one snare drum, I hope I'm saying that right, <laughs> one cymbal, one stool, one set of drumsticks, and three stands. Out of the box, there is some light assembly required. Good thing they give you instructions. The first item is the bass drum. It is navy blue with silver designs. On the front, there are stars and lightning bolts. At the bottom, there are two legs and the pedal. The pedal comes off easily, but don't worry, it just pops right back on. The pedal actually works, so your doll can step on it and actually play the drum. And I think that's so cute and so realistic. See? That is so cute! Now, moving on to the next item. Next, we have the snare drum. I don't know if I'm still not saying that right. It attaches to these, this stand, and you need to carefully follow the instructions because like you see here, I am struggling to put this back on. It's a little bit difficult, but once you get it on, it won't come off. It is navy blue again with silver designs, and then there's a stand that attaches so it is twisty. Now, let's move on to the next item. Next we have the chair. It is black with a cushion design on the top. It is a rubber plastic because it sounds like rubber when you tap it, but it feels like plastic. And it is a twisty chair. Lastly, we have the symbol and it is attached to the stand and it actually works. And we can't forget the drumsticks. The drumsticks are really cute, they're so little. They're a light tan and they have silver handles so your dolls can hold them. Excuse me because I do not know how to play the drums, but hey, it's doll sized. No one can resist not playing drums on a doll sized drum set. Overall, I think this set is so adorable, and I can't wait to set up a scene with my dolls, and I think that Logan's going to look so cute with it. Now, the long-awaited time of American Girl's first 18-inch boy doll, Logan Everest. As you can tell, the first thing you will see is that the box is different. They did this for Gabriella's boxes as well. They're going to be making all the new American Girl boxes like this. Now, let's take a look at the back of the box. On the back of the box, it shows a picture of Logan on Tenny's stage. In the corner, it says Logan is Tenny's bandmate and drummer. I think the thing that's strange, though, is that on the back of the box, it shows Logan with brown eyes, but Logan actually has bluish gray eyes. So, I think that's a little funny. Now, let's get this boy doll out of the box. 
And here is Logan out of the box. He has Kai's face mold. He has a dimple on his chin and his nose. He has thick eyebrows and brown hair. He has gray eyes and his hair is swept back. For his top, he is wearing a plaid shirt. It is blue, green, and white. It has a collar, working pockets, and you see the buttons on the shirt. They don't velcro and they don't actually work. It's just for decoration. His sleeves do button, or like they show on the back of the box, you can also roll them up. See? He is wearing a aqua green colored shirt. It is a short sleeve t-shirt and it says play loud and it has a picture of a drum set on it that matches his drum set, which I think is so cute. The shirt velcros in the back and as you can tell, he doesn't have strings, he has zip ties. So you need to be careful not to make your doll's limbs super loose. For his pants, he is wearing black jeans. They have working pockets on both sides. The pants velcro in the front and he is wearing boxers. He is wearing gray, white, and blue sneakers. And him and Tenny have new hand molds so they can hold their instruments. And last but not least, we have Tenny Grant. She also has the new box, and this doll is just so gorgeous. I cannot wait to get her out of the box. Look how beautiful she is. Now let's take a look at the back of the box. On the back of the box, it shows a picture of Tenny Grant on her stage holding her guitar. On the bottom corner, it says, Tenny Grant. I'm a songwriter determined to make music straight from the heart. Out of the box, she has blonde hair, brown eyes, she has freckles by her nose, and peach reddish lips. Now it's time to get her hair knit off and see this beautiful hair. Just be careful though, because I had a little trouble getting her hair knit off. Because every time I tried to grab it, as you see here, I ended up pulling her hair. This doll is so beautiful. Look at that hair. It is gorgeous. Be careful though, because it's like Lainey's hair. So try not to brush it so much or else it will be frizzy. She is wearing a short sleeve jean jacket. There are fake pockets, a little design at the top corner, and star buttons. She is also wearing a peach shirt with a maroon bird that says sing your story. There is a tied design at the bottom. Also with her you get a charm bracelet. It is pink and it has a star, a rhinestone charm, and a music note. She is wearing a faux leather maroon colored skirt and she has pink underwear and her shoes are brown closed-toed sandals and they velcro on the side and of course she comes with a book overall I am so happy that I can add Tenny and Logan to my collection and I hope that you would like to add them to yours if you like this video make sure to press the like button down below and subscribe to my channel have a nice day goodbye